I met with Mary Barry yesterday, and we had a, a lengthy conversation about the layoffs, the cause of the layoffs. It's a great disappointment, obviously. The president indicated his own disappointment. Um, he believes, as uh, frankly the Prime Minister of Canada, Trudeau, believes, that the USMCA deal was a great help to the automobile industry and to auto workers. And uh, by the way, they made those statements separately. And yet, GM comes in right after the deal. By the way, that deal will be signed in Argentina uh, with the U.S. Uh, and Canadian representatives. So there's great disappointment there. Um, there's disappointment that it seems like GM would rather build its electric cars in China rather than in the United States. Um, we are going to be looking at certain subsidies regarding electric cars and others, whether they should apply or not. I can't say anything final about that, but we're looking into it. Again, that reflects the President's own disappointment regarding these actions. Uh, Ms. Barrett told me, on the other hand, I want to be completely fair here, it's her business, um, it may be possible to transfer workers to other plants in Texas and Michigan. Uh, I, I, I'm not an expert on General Motors, I'm not an analyst, uh, auto analyst, but that's what she said. But obviously there's a lot of disappointment, even anger. Uh, I've heard it, again, from Mr. Trudeau, from President Trump, from Democrats and Republicans. Just to follow, do you think it's going to adversely affect our economy coming into the Christmas season and after? No. Um, I mean, look, I don't want anybody to get laid off. Uh, I'm, I, I want workers to do very well. I want worker wages to do well, and they are. I mean, that's one of the great things. You know, there's a certain amount of pessimism that I'm reading about. Um, maybe it has to do with a really a mild stock market correction. Let's not forget a couple of weeks ago, just on this very point, we had 250,000 new jobs, which was a blockbuster number. Nobody really expected it. With a 3.1 percent yearly gain in wages and a 3.7 percent unemployment rate, those are very spiffy numbers by any benchmark in any metric. So, again, holiday season layoffs from GM, brutal, brutal, all right? Uh, very disappointing. Will it affect the overall economy? I don't think so. 